going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm back here again with another video and today we're going to be striking a deal with one of our locals. He actually sells at the flea market and it looks like he came about a collection that was worth anywhere from five to ten thousand uh, dollars. I was looking at some of this stuff and then I let him know I was like yo this is just too crazy stuff that I just got to get it on camera. So we're going to be trying to strike a deal negotiating the best we can and getting the best value for our money. Um, if you are brand new to this channel make sure you do subscribe, like the video as well as commenting. Uh, I do want to thank you guys again because we're so close to a thousand subscribers. Now we're at almost 600. So, uh, you know, we want to do a giveaway. Actually, you know what? We'll just think of the giveaway right now. Uh, to enter the giveaway, make sure you subscribe to the channel, like this video, and comment. And you will win two cream stock blasters. So, that's the giveaway. So, if we reach a thousand subscribers, hopefully by the next video or the next two videos, I'll do a giveaway. Uh, do a randomizer and you'll win two premium stock blasters premium stock blasters last uh set of zion stuff so enter the giveaway guys good luck thank you again for watching and hope you guys enjoy let's go Eighty-nine Fleer. 87 88 this is 1980 89. Like these are immaculate, Scott. Like these, I think you should grade these. I really think you should grade these. Like, it's crazy how nice it is. Yeah, it was unbelievable when I opened the box and found those. Uh, and then this one's with the shack rookie, right? Yeah, it's got the shack rookie. This one's got a shack rookie in the front. Kind of can't see it, but these are the both scores. Wow, these are like immaculate. Well, I opened the box and pulled one. Oh, so you pulled these? Uh, I pulled one of them. Yeah. Yeah. Just a couple days ago. Were, the, were these one of one of these worth? Yeah. Okay. They look really good. Did that one, I believe. Yeah, they've been going up pretty decently lately. Yeah, they have. What about this one? Were you able to find this in the deal, or? Yeah, this, it was in that deal. This is nice. We'll look at some Jeter too. There's the black gold. What's the what's the, behind this? What's the story behind this? It was a, coming a winter set. You get set A and set B. Mm -hmm and uh, Shaq coming set B. Everybody like locally loves Chipper. Yeah, oh, nice. the EX2000. Yeah, that's nice. That's beautiful. See, like stuff like this. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, like even like stuff like this, even if you don't watch baseball or something, I just think the, the look of the card in like a PSA case, oh, yeah. it just brings value. I'm sorry, but... You know what's crazy about this this card? This was my first ever Jordan card that I ever found myself. Yeah. And I've had it pristine since I was like seven years old. Like I lost all my cards growing up and this was the one card that just stayed in a top loader sleeve and it looks like it's a, a pristine card. Yeah, that's awesome. Like, and I still haven't sent it off to get graded. That's crazy. But like seeing that card, like back then when I was a kid, like this card just meant so much to me and I just can't ever get rid of it. Oh yeah, yeah. That's like it. Even though it's maybe like a three, five dollar card, it's just like stuff like that. It, you know, it just means a lot. Oh, you know, rings. I've sold some for like seven on up to 12 people be bidding on them. That's, that's what I'm saying. Like stuff like, like MJ is always in demand. It doesn't matter what year. Like yeah. that's the stuff about like his stuff is always just going to be in demand. That's why I, I like his stuff. It's easy to move. Um, like these Shaq Hoops rookies are like immaculate. Yeah. That's the way the entire collection was. And I, it just blew me away. It just, I guess open it and put it up. Do you know how much these are pulling in? I'm not really sure. Yeah, we can look them up. I mean, There's a lot of it that I haven't got to comp because I've got so much of it that I've just oh, been yeah. having a ball going through it. <laughs> yeah. Like the first, first day I got it, I stayed up at 6 o'clock in the morning going just, through stuff. She said, you're crazy. Just looking through it? Yeah, just looking through stuff. But it was, but I that's just couldn't how go I, to bed. I was just so excited. But that, that's how I'd be too. Like if I ever came across this kind of collection, like, like I love to run up numbers. So like just looking at all this and literally just comping everything like at a comparable price and like whenever I do stuff like I always look at like settle prices so I'm like okay yeah I comp to like 50 but I know I can get 30 for it. So I like to go at settle prices. Yeah.
stadium clubs. Mm -hmm. I think people sleep on the stadium clubs, yeah. like especially the chrome stadium clubs. Like uh, it just reminds me of like the old tops chrome photography. Mm -hmm. They're like, they just stand out a little more. So this Larry Bird and Maj and this is his true, like these are their rookie, but it's not together. So it's kind of like a, is it kind of like the second tiered rookie, I guess? I guess maybe so. Whenever I have sealed wax, I'm like, yeah, you know, maybe there is that one of one Zion, but gosh, you know, you open one cello and it's like you get Taco Fall. It's yeah. like, man, God, I don't know. It just gives yeah, you. You'd rather have the, what you can sell pack for. Exactly. 26, 66, 52, 71, 31. Um, I'd be at, I'd do 35. Would you do 35 for this one? Probably be like in the middle. Since we're local, I mean, I'm I'm willing to pay pretty much seventy percent of eBay. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, and then if we could save a little more because it's all in bulk, I mean, yeah, that, that'd be cool too. But you know, like this stuff is in demand, so you know, I'm not gonna lowball the hell out of you. You know what I mean? Yeah, stuff you you're not gonna sell. Yeah, exactly. With Tatis, I'd be at like. 75 to 80 if we can work on that and if not i mean we can set it to the side and then like i said once we have everything comp because this is pretty much the stack i want yeah, that's, uh, that's yeah so i know this one for sure like pierce i've gotten some in bulk at like 10 bucks each i mean would you be doing like eight on this yeah. for the three it looks pretty good i'd be at like 10 per 10 per 26 bids too like those those are actual like comps yeah like when it shows like multiple bids yeah if it just shows one bid that yeah. you know you don't really know if somebody bought it these like the, these uh finest they're moving at like there's one for three one for eight one sold for 15 one sold for 12. i'd do five per i mean like i get it you know people they won't give him his credit because of the steroid news. I, I do get it. But man, he was Showtime. You know what I mean? Like, he was box office. That's the way I look at it. Um, you know, people like, look at yeah, it different. They wrote the call for gambling, you know, they won't let him in. But. Yeah, I mean, and that too, like, it's like, they were. he was just iconic at one point. Like, that's that's why, I, like, with, That's not discredit how he played, you ex know? Exactly, like, with sports cards, whenever I look at cards, like, if I'm looking at long-term value, I'm looking at, like, were they really iconic? Like, did they set the bar? Like, like was they were they box office? Were you willing to pay to see this person? Yeah. And like Barry Bonds from baseball at one point was like one of those players. It's like, you know, we gotta watch Barry Bonds. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. I'd do ten for the three if you're willing to do that. Yeah. Okay. Coins at fourteen bits, twenty three, twenty seven on best offer accepted, thirty, twenty six on eight bids. I'd do. I'd do 20 a piece. Yeah. Uh, those I really have to hold off on. I've, I've, the other three I sold, I sold two for 100 a piece and one for 150. Okay. Because of their condition, the guy was going to trade. Gotcha. And I may come back to these then. Yeah. Um, yeah. If we if we work more, you know, we could probably we could probably get those. Did I ever hit prism? I never hit optic. Um, neither prism. Like it's 
crazy. It's like, man, th this stuff really comes out in the stores and you just don't see it. It's like, yeah. man, that's, that's just wild. It's because there's some of them, they call them till I am getting ready to put this out. And exactly. They're standing there waiting until they put it out, it's all gone. It's because there's so much money in it that they... Yeah, I mean, it's understandable though. So, hey, you got to get it how you can. I personally, like with wax, I really don't mind paying the secondary price because I think it still goes up. Like, like optic, I wish I would have bought blasters at like 70 a piece. You know, now they're like 100. So, you know, you bought 700 worth, now it's like, you know, close to a thousand and stuff. So, it's, it always has room to grow. It's just that, man, if you can get it for MSRP, oh, yeah. <laughs> that is really, really money, yeah, it's crazy. Like, prism hangers are, what, 140 a piece? That's crazy. Well, I think mosaic basketball is still very undervalued. Uh, mosaic football, I think, is moving too lately. Uh... But it's weird, man. You just can never tell how the market's gonna move. I try to buy as like the best as I can. Um, what were you thinking on the bows? So I mean, I'd be at 12 per. I'd do 25 for both if you want to move. Them. And I mean, if not, you know, we can set these to the side and still come up with it. We'll have our total price, and then you know we can always add it on later. Yeah, we can do that. Okay. So we're at 380. Potentially the deal. He's, he's thinking it over. Uh, throwing one mosaic hanger for him. Uh, we got a bunch of wall stuff. This is 95, just Jordans. They look really good. Uh, he was wanting five a piece. But uh, in total, so like this stack here was 380. And so I'm pretty much talking the Jordans down and then getting the Reggies and the Bo Jacks and, and the Kareem stickers for cheaper. So I do 750, one mosaic hanger. I'll value the mosaic hanger around 850 bucks. So like it's pretty much $800 in total. We'll see what he says. Like I said, it'll be a 750 in total with cash and then I'll throw in the mosaic hanger. All that came to 1055. Yeah, so I'd be at, like I said, because I'm buying the whole thing, you know, just take a little portion off. Yeah. I mean, I'm throwing in the hanger too. So like in total, like what I'm thinking, this value is, I'll, I'll value this at like 60. Uh, so like in total, what I'm paying, you said you're at 1,055 in total? What I'm paying in total is probably like 825. But, you know, I'm moving mo all of it off of you. And it's cash. I'd probably be more like at 900, that's, that's knocking 155 off. You know, I mean, I'm blowing those out dirt cheap. I'll throw in, Three premium stock sellers. So, I mean, that's value. That's pretty much your 900. Because you get the hanger and you get the three sellers, and they're, you know, 30 bucks a piece or 25 a piece. So, I'd be at 900. That's pretty much in total 900. If you're willing to do that. We came this, this far. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like, know. Uh, like, I want raw stuff. But I know that it's on hold for me right now. You would like an 800, I'd do it. 800, the total payment plus this? That and the two and the, and the two, which hangers are you wanting? Uh, Premium stock? Yeah, that's fine. Thank you, Scott. Yeah, thank you, man. Thank you, man. For sure. I'm here to leave for that. All right, awesome. So I'll just show up real quick. We got, I'm, you said there was 95 Jordans? Yeah. yeah. So we got 95 Jordans, um, bunch of raw. Big shout out to Scott. Go and check out, what's the name of the auction place? Uh, Nick Junk Shack, live auctions on right. Facebook. Oh, that was big. So, recapping everything, guys. Found a bunch of raw stuff, bunch of Jordans. It was 95 Jordans, I think it was. A uh, bunch of raw Shaq, Kareem sticker, 1986 Fleer. I look at stuff that's always in demand, that will always be in demand. Um, it's a pretty good, pretty good haul. We'll get back to the house, take a look at it. And yeah, what's going on guys? Now we're back here and uh, just wanted to show you guys pretty much everything we ended up picking up. In total, we spent about, it was 900 net out of everything, you know, with the wax that I included as well. Um, so it's about 900 bucks. So 
Uh, I want to show you guys here. There was 95 Jordans. You know, like, they're pretty pretty good they look easy to move they're all penny sleeve too and they looked really good like all of these honestly like i looked through them they're probably like mint eights or near mint eights at the very least like they all look extremely promising um i could do these at auction probably and you know even do like a facebook fire so and probably move these that maybe i'd say like seven bucks a piece five bucks at the least uh, and then just some of the stuff that I ended up pull, uh, picking up here. Uh, we got a refractor of uh, Topps Finest, uh, Tripper Jones, EX2000. I love this, guys. The Kareem Abdul-Jabbar 1986 Fleer, the sticker. This is an iconic set. I just couldn't pass up on this. It looks really good. It is a little off-centered, but this honestly looks like maybe a, a PSA 7. Um, you know, I factored into pricing that PSA is shut down. So, I mean, a bunch of these cards I'm buying for the long haul. Um, and I'll be grading them once they, you know, reopen back their business. Uh, some score, Barry, uh, both Jackson rookies, excuse me. Uh, two Reggie Millers. They look really, really good, really sharp. Um, a bunch of this stuff that he had, guys, it was like, it's like literally these cards were just kept in immaculate condition. Um, they look really great for their age. A Jeter Pinnacle, a Taps, Tops Black Gold of Shaq, Jordan Insert. I love these Michael versus Magics. I was thinking about sending these off to HGA and getting like a custom label slab, maybe red and yellow or red and gold. And uh, if not, I mean, I'll just hold them off for PSA. I know they'll look good in PSA cases. Uh, same thing here again, more Magic and, and Michael. I just think stuff like this over time just holds some value Two Iconic Legends. Uh, I picked up like seven of those. Shaq's Hoops Rookies, um, yeah, there's like, Jesus, I thought I had like three, I guess I picked up four, picked up four Shaq's Hoops Rookies, they look really good as well, like a bunch of this stuff that I found, guys, like the vintage, like, I guess you could say, call it vintage, but a bunch of this 90s stuff, 80s stuff, it looks like, at the very least, uh, PSA 7s or PSA 8s, uh, three Barry Bonds, this is a Topps Finest of Barry Sanders insert, and Fuego Shack, Top's Finest. Uh, these with the, they have the coating. Pierce Rookie with the coating. Marino Rookie. This Tatis, I got a pretty sick deal on this as well in the bulk deal. Um, it looked really, really good too. Uh, the Larry Bird Rookie. This is like the second tier rookie as well as uh, the Magic second tier as well. And then a Bo Bichette first Bowman Chrome. Let me know what you guys think about these pickups, guys. Uh, I really, really enjoyed working with Scott. He's a local. You know, I've done plenty of business with him. Please make sure that you do comment, subscribe, and like this video so that you can be entered into the giveaway. Again, we will be given two NBA Hoops premium stock blasters uh, once we reach 1,000 subscribers. So good luck to the winner once we reach that number. Uh, we're going to be having more giveaways in the future. A lot more show content coming up again, guys. So thank you, thank you so much again for supporting the channel. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, I'm really excited about the future of our channel. I really appreciate all the support from you guys. Thank you again for tuning in, and we will see you guys on the next one. Take care.